What's up, Atinis? Welcome back to Redemption 46 Studios. I'm Nick. Man, y'all seen the picture? Y'all seen the thumbnail? Y'all know exactly why y'all here. ATs, it's you. You know what I need you to do? I need you to hit that subscribe button. Become a real redeemer today for more content like this. Jump on the Patreon. We got some exclusive AT stuff up on there. We did the Mama 2023 version. Um, the choreo battle to, uh, what was, what did we just do? I think it was uh, Bouncy and Crazy Form. Bouncy and Crazy Form. And like I said, the Mama for 2023 is up on there. Also, it's other some exclusive some more exclusive stuff that they got blocked. Um, they, they wasn't showing us no love. They was blocking everything. But uh, make sure y'all subscribe. Y'all been banging on the table telling me the new uh, drop is out. No long talk, man. Let's jump into this. Let's see what's up with the what's up. Um, you know, it's AT, so I'm expecting greatness. I'm expecting some crazy choreo. I'm expecting the vocals to be on point. I want to hear some rap stuff. Um, it's 2024, man. We, we need all these bangers to come out here, so... Let me turn all this up, give ATs the respect that they do. Let's jump into this, man. Let's see what's up with the what's up. Make sure y'all subscribe, man. Stop playing. Trauma. They're about to pull up on him. It's a K drama. It's lit. You turn us up in the headphone. Shout out to the editor. Vocals. That's catchy. Lyrics is crazy. <laughs> Ew. What the, uh, the Peter Pan run. Yes, 
<laughs> Make sure y'all subscribe, man. Jump on the Patreon. Um, it's going to be some new ET stuff on there. I got to see if it's a live performance to this or a dance practice. They was showing they ass off. I wanted to... I thought I didn't even know I hit the other mode on for you. Um, this was fire, man. For so many different reasons. So, um, first off, make sure y'all subscribe, and if y'all haven't watched all the other AT stuff, jump in the comments, and, um, and, you know, we'll, we'll talk about the AT stuff. I didn't know I had this feature up on here. I, f I forgot this was up on here. Um, this was fire in so many different ways. Um, so with ATs, you know, when we were first introduced to them, they seemed larger than life um, in the sense of like everything was grandiose. Um, the performances felt like you can only appreciate them in like a live performance or a concert setting. Like they were so like grand and big. Um, with that being said, once we got into more of their discography, we found out like, yo, they have so many different sounds. Um, you know, they, they had shit that sound like party music almost from like the early 2000s. Um, so, you know, it's rare that you get into artists whose discography gets so vast that, like, you know, I, I want to say, I guess, like, I, obviously a lot of groups have things that sound like their sound. Um, like, you know, sometimes you'll hear certain AT songs and you'll just be like, oh, okay, like, that's really, like, you know, if I had to pinpoint, like, one sound, that's kind of their sound. But they're not really limited to that. And I think songs like this really help when you know you start putting them into like you know top five categories or where you hold them at like in music um just because this sounds like a r&b kind of pop song early 2000s i was loving the vibe the melody the groove and just the overall aesthetic of the video and the production this is super catchy it feels super marketable it feels like a great comeback it feels like um also something that other people aren't doing. And I love that within K-pop where like, if everybody sounds like they're on this type time and you're on this type time, it just makes you a bit different than basically the whole industry. And ATs finds a way to do that just so often. Um, the video wasn't doing too much, but it was shot and edited so beautifully. Um, just somehow they find a way to have like those darker color palettes sometimes where it's like those blues and like greens that seem like dark but they'll add like their color pops or use lighting in an efficient way to just make the video not feel like they're in gotham city or some shit like it's not super you know just uh like super just black outside um and it, and it worked so well even uh like the fits and everything this wasn't a comeback where everybody you know had crazy color hair or you know or the fits were like super vibrant um but somehow it was still appeasing and it still worked um it still felt like you still felt their personality um even though the fits weren't very like you know just like like popping but i i really like this a lot like i said it felt free um it, it felt different and i like that um like the lyrics too was hit, and I think right here when they did the Peter Pan riff, um, it made me think about when I first got back in. Well, when I yeah, when I first got back into K-pop, um, you know, essentially naming it four years ago, um, and just you know, the lyrics almost feeling like poetry. I used to say when I first got back in, I'm like, damn, it felt like people was doing hakus or something like that. Um, but I, I really like this a lot. I would like to see a choreo, um, like, you know, dance practice or something for this. And also just a live performance because, um, that a long time ago with Atis, that I'm not going to call it like a knock because it's not really a knock. It was more so like, I, I remember the, remember how I told y'all that we always thought the songs were so grand that we actually wanted to see a different side of them. 
we wanted to see songs that were a bit more subtle in the approach um as in like you know maybe something that didn't need to be theatrical or be like so grand and the first thing people did was they put us on like a lot of like the b-sides that are a bit more like chill even though some of the b-sides are still like kind of like you know grand and everything um but this definitely falls in the category of <clears throat> those at songs that are a bit more chill um the ones that, and when i mean chill i just mean like you know uh, like trumpets don't need to be playing uh, The confetti isn't popping Like you know it's not a thousand moving parts As far as like the choreography And everything Something to where you know they can be on stage And it's more like sexy more intimate And more you know kind of like Just um, I don't want to use the word like toned down But just something that's a bit more like com Like more chill um, And I, I told you I like that Just because it, it works with the duality Of the discography it just makes them just like, you know, like I'm pretty sure y'all watch verses like when artists do like their verses and everything like that. If ATS was to do like a verses, they just have so many different bags that they can jump into and so many different sounds just to prove that, you know, we're not just a one trick pony. And things like this just only help with that argument. Um, so I like this a lot, man. I can't wait to jump in some more. Uh, I feel like at this point we did a B side on the album already. And then we did the choreo battle that's up on the Patreon. And we uh, also did the Mama the 2023 that's up on the Patreon as well. Um, so yeah, jump on there today. Uh, I'm going to see what B-Sides is left on there and to see if they have a dance practice or a live performance of this. Um, but man, thank y'all for the love and support. Y'all could have been anywhere else in the world, but y'all decided to be here. Um, yeah, man, this was a good one, man. I like this. This was catchy. Um, this is going to be marketable, too, man. I feel like there's a bunch of different applications for this. Uh, but I'm not going to talk y'all to death, man. Uh, jump in the comments. Let me know how y'all felt about this. This was this was clean. I feel like that the overall feel of this was just, like, super clean. Damn, the, choreogra the choreography is, is, is clean, too, man. I'm loving these fits. I got to get out of here. I'm, I can talk about them for a little minute. Um, more videos coming soon. Love and appreciate y'all. I'm going to holla at y'all. Peace.